Alright, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to create an animation from your viewpoints. Okay, so the first thing that we need to do, we need to create viewpoints. Okay, so from the view tab, Windows tool, you click the drop down and then let's look for save viewpoints. So I'm going to select that one. So this is where I'm going to save my viewpoints. Okay, so let's say this is my first viewpoint. So to save this, I just need to right click here and then select say viewpoint. So that's my viewpoint number one. And then I'm going to orbit just to say uh, change the angle. So right click again here, say viewpoint. Okay, right click again here. So you can also uh, pan your drawing and then right click, say viewpoint. Okay, and then orbit, right click, say viewpoint, enter. And then for my last viewpoint, so let's say here's my last viewpoint. So right click, save viewpoint. Okay, enter. So of course, you can always rename your viewpoints here by right clicking and then selecting rename here. Now, to create an animation out from your save viewpoints, so all you have to do is to just right click again here on your save viewpoints window. And then you can see there's an add animation here. So just click add animation. So there's your animation. Okay. Again, you can change the name of this one if you want. So I'm just going to press enter to accept the default name. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to put all of these viewpoints inside my animation. Okay. So to do that, you can drag one by one. And there you go. So I now have one view here. So you can also select multiple views by holding by clicking one view and then holding the shift on your keyboard and then clicking the last uh, view there to select all of the view. And then after that, you can drag that again and then put it in the animation folder. There you go. So I now have your animation here. All the viewpoints is on that animation. Okay, so to start, so all you have to do is to go to your animation tab and then you can see here your animation. Okay, so that's your animation. Okay, so to play that, so you can see there's a play icon there. So you just need to click that one. And there you go. So you just created your viewpoint animation. Okay, so if this viewpoint is already okay for you so what you can do is you can export the animation so that's why you have export animation here okay so if you want to export so i'll just stop this one and then you can select here export animation and then you can just uh, set up the settings of your uh, animation export Okay, so for the source, you can select the source here. For me, I'll just select here current animation. Renderer, you can click the drop down there. I'll just use the viewpoint renderer. Okay, and then what's the output? So instead of uh, JPEG, so I can change that to Windows, AVI, and then you can also change the options here. So whatever uh, type of compressor that you want, so for me, I'll just select here full frames uncompressed. Okay, and then you can change here the size, the type, width, height. So you can select here use view. So that's the default settings of your view. And then you can adjust here the FPS. Okay, so I think this one is up to 100. Wonder if I can make that higher value oh i'm not going to do that so how about i'll just make it 10 okay and then that's it i'll just select okay and then you just need to save it okay so let's say i'll just put it in my documents i'll just create a folder here and then i'll call it uh, videos okay and then i'll just go inside and then you can just change the name here so let's say that's my exterior animation okay and then after that just save it okay so that's it 
so it's now starting to export and then once this finish you can now play your animation in AVI format okay so let's see how it looks like once it's finished okay so done so let's go to our uh, video videos double click there you go so that's now your animation in avi file so hopefully you learned something from this video thank you for watching have a nice day